Hello folks, welcome to Spelling Bee round 15. Today I have my guest, Saborno Isaac Berry, and today I'm going to quiz him on 10 words which he has not seen before. His task will be to spell each of these 10 words correctly to move on to round 16. Are you ready? Look at this stupid man's face. <laughs> I'll take that as a yes. <laughs> So, you are not allowed to look behind you, or okay. you, you will be disqualified if you look behind you. Sal, you're not the host. Okay, so, first word is, only the audience will be able to see the word. And if you want, you can ask for the definition, or for me to use it in a sentence. The first word is, elegy. Or some people pronounce it as elegy, so. Oh, that's stupid. E-L-E-G-Y. A sad what? Okay, yeah. Maybe? It's, Possibly? I've never yeah. looked at the definition before. So for example, it can be a tribute to someone famous, like an elegy for Sir Isaac Newton after he dies. Something or like Or Abraham Lincoln. Maybe. Okay. I actually read an elegy. Next Wait. word. Are you ready Shut for up! Are you ready for the next word? Okay. Maybe your confidence will get lower after the next word. Let's see. Look at this. So the next word is illicit. Illicit. E-L-I-C-I-T. Illicit. That is correct. Good job. Look at this. But what does it mean? What does it mean? It basically mean? means to uh it basically means to cause. Yes, to so provoke like, a response. So like if you elicited Refat screaming because his spelling bee was way too easy for me, uh that would be because you got all of the questions right. So that's what elicit means. Okay. <laughs> Look at this dude, he thinks he can trap me. Okay, next word. Next word, let us see. Eloquence. Eloquence. Be careful. Your confidence. E L O Q U E N T E. Okay, so you got three of the words for Next word. Your jabbering inspires me to jab you with a fork. Yeah. Anyway. Okay. Eminent. Eminent. If you want me to use. E L I N E N T. Say it slowly. E M I N E N T. That is correct. <laughs> this guy is making a comedy so I was spelling me. <laughs> okay, what does eminent mean? Uh, for something to be famous. Yeah, some for example Stephen Hawking was an physicist. Okay, just like me, soon. No, <laughs> not soon. Never I've already that. published Okay, next word. Uh, moving on. Empirical. Em e M P I R I C A L. Wait, slowly, slowly. E M P I R I C A L. Let's go back. Correct. Empirical. And what is the definition? For something to be uh, tested using experiments. Yeah, for example, it has been found Stop. that methane hydrate is. Stable in a very small high pressure region. Okay, empirically, via experimental evidence. And two plasmid hydrates. Okay, <laughs> next word emulate. E M U L A T E. Emulate means to mimic, you don't have to ask me, you stupid. Yes, to imitate someone. Okay? Mm -hmm. And imitation is the sincerest form of flattery, right? So thank you for imitating. Okay, next word. Enervate. Enervate. If you want me to use it in a sentence or uh, pronounce it. Enervate. Okay. Can you say it slower? Sure. <laughs> Enervate. Okay, must start with an E. Can you say, say its definition? Enervate. The definition is to exhaust. Or I can use it in a sentence. Okay, use it in a sentence. He, um, he tried all of the cutoffs possible for the N2 class rate hydrate, but instead he enervated all possibilities. <laughs> anyway, uh, pretend like that never happened, and now. And enervate. Enervate. Be careful. Okay. E and no, enervate. E N E R 
V-A-T-E. That is correct. Good job. You thought you could trick me into thinking it was an A? I'm not that no. stupid, Zach. I was just trying to benefit you by giving you the pronunciation. Now, no, you don't, weren't. Don't look you this think way. I'm fucking crazy? Keep looking that way. I'm looking at this way. Okay, okay. next word. Engender. Engender. E-N-G-E-N-D-E-R. Slowly, uh, slowly. Okay. As in E N. Yeah. And then gender. G E N D E R. Okay, and what does it mean? The same as emulate, I think. No, engender means to give rise to. So, for example, oh. you can engender a, okay, okay, I don't a need positive to make you work sus, life balance sus, sus. in your research group. Okay. Okay. Okay, and are you ready for the next word? So, so far, yeah. you've, you've spelled all of the words correctly. Which is either very impressive or very suspicious, depending on <laughs> depending on your point of view. Okay, <laughs> next word is enhance. E N H A N C E. Okay, I guess this. I don't know why I chose this. One. It was very easy. What does it mean? To upgrade. To help. To intensify. For example. Shut up. I enhance my research output. All right, fight me. Okay, entitlement. Entitlement. E-N-T-I-T-L-E-M-E-N-T -E -E That is correct, but what does it mean? Something that Karen's have. Okay, but explain. Uh, okay. Entitlement is basically your right to something. Okay. So like your entitlement to, say, guns or food. Right, so for example, you are in... Oh, nice! Um, that... I'm in now yeah, that, so there are two main definitions of entitlement. One is, for example, the Second Amendment entitles everyone to own a, a private firearm uh, to protect them. Uh, Themselves. Right. And the second definition of entitlement is you act arrogant. Okay. So, uh, for example, Karen. you might say some physicists are entitled. So, and uh, that is uh, the end of spelling bee.